my name is Andrew Garbett. I'm the director of golf grounds and slope maintenance. Snowmaking, grooming, golf, all the grounds maintenance that happens on the hill, that's all under my umbrella. The process to making snow really starts with making sure that your equipment is good to go at the start of the year. So having your air compressor serviced, your pump serviced, making sure that all your capabilities from a machine standpoint, you have all your ducks in a row for the season coming. And then from there, you're waiting for wet bulb temperature. The easiest way to describe wet bulb is it's the temperature that resides between the actual air temperature and the dew point. You know, if the humidity is relatively low, you're gonna have a better wet bulb. People might see minus two and a half and say, why isn't uh, snowmaking fired up? Well, it's because the wet bulb and the humidity is too high and we can't make snow at that. So what's new this year after the project that we just completed is we installed flood lines on Cruiser and Dr. Doug, Spec and Avalanche and Little Devil and Larway. And we put in two new valve houses on Larway and one on Dr. Doug. We also installed 24 new locations at the top of the village, which strengthens up the density of the snowmaking up there. It just spaced the guns out a little less. And uh, we included some locations up on the top of Cruiser at South as well to get us up to the top of Southern Comfort. Overall, that's everything that's new. We are, we're also adding in some live webcams so that people can log on, check the webcams and conditions before they actually drive up here to see what it's really like. The part that I'm most excited about and, and what I think is the biggest highlight is a flood line. Snowmaking is a hard job. And if we can make it easier by firing up 25 guns with the push of a button, I think that benefits everybody. They're not a common thing that you see around other resorts. So that kind of makes this project unique to us. We have about 850 snow guns total. Uh, we have 17 flood lines and we have about 28 sled guns. We essentially have 350 acres-ish of skiable terrain with 850 guns. So we have about 2.5 guns per acre. You know, in our local area, the Georgian Bay area, there's a, there's a misconception that we take a lot more water from the bay than we actually do. We don't, we don't often pull from the bay, we usually pull from our ponds. And the way the hill works is, as we lose water, it makes its way back to the golf ponds. These ponds are a catch-all for everything that comes off the hill and runs back to the bay. So, in a sense, we're almost always recycling the water out of our ponds. If we go through a thaw, that snow melts, it runs back through the, the system, ends back up in our golf ponds, and then we fire up again and put it back out on the hill. With us opening on December 12th this year, I just think that it's gonna be worthwhile for people to come to the resort and see all the work that we've done. We are a lot more capable, which means we're gonna have snow out there faster and there's gonna be a lot more of it.